If you want to start a debate in current day society, bring up the topic of Vietnam. Some people believe it was a noble cause, other people believe it was a huge mistake. We don't try to settle that argument here at the National Cryptologic Museum. What we try to do is to provide a perspective on the cryptologic elements of the war. From the earliest days of the conflict, cryptologists were on the ground getting critical information. In fact, one of the very first people killed in Vietnam was Specialist James Davis of the United States Army. By the mid-1960s, though, a vast network of listening posts was established throughout the area of operation. These individuals gathered critical information from both the Viet Cong and North Vietnamese Army and forwarded it back to individuals who could use it to gain victory on the battlefield and to also gain critical knowledge of what the enemy was about to do. Because of the actions of these individuals, thousands of lives were saved. Now, it is a fact that we lost over 60,000 people during the Vietnam War, but had these individuals not done the job the way they did, we probably would have lost more. The bottom line is, though, is that cryptology played a critical role in the conflict and that thousands of lives were saved.